everyone, my name is Jo and I'm here today with a torrid haul. Although this isn't your average torrid haul, this is a torrid clearance haul. So for those of you that have been on this channel for a while, you'll know I'm a little bit cheap and a bargain shopper and I never pay full price for anything and so I don't earn torrid cash. I always shop their clearance. Well, I'm actually really a new torrid shopper. I didn't shop torrid until this year like this is this order i'm about to show you is my third order from torrid ever and the first one i got because they sent me a ten dollar birthday uh coupon so i got some really cheap cloths which i've been wearing and then i was like well I'll, i have some I, I had i think two or three torrid dresses that i got from a charity shop a thrift store and those were size one so then i tried ordering a dress in a size one and i really liked it and then i started shopping torrid at thread up and i really liked it so i i'm a new torrid shopper and but torrid's expensive it's quite expensive and not all the materials are great quality or so i'm discovering um i've ordered a few tops from thread up and they're all synthetic and that like material that gauzy material that catches and gets like you know thready and when i look on the websites the same top is like 30 or 40 dollars and i don't think that's worth it what i do think is worth it are the dresses but i still don't want to pay 60 70 dollars for a dress especially when in clearance you can get a dress like this for 25 dollars so i hit the clearance for this dress at 50% off some of the items I got when it was 40% off so I'll tell you how much I paid and how much I got off but this dress this beautiful summer dress I got for 24 I think 50 or 24.99 and I love it the belt is mine I'll show you about the belt in a minute let me come up nice and close so you can see the beautiful stripes now I made sure I read all the reviews because unfortunately torrid clearance is non-returnable so it's non-refundable non-returnable you buy it you're stuck with it and so i read everything i could to make sure i wasn't getting something that i wouldn't like and this one had very favorable reviews someone said her husband calls it her candy striper dress it, it's lovely it's such a lovely summer dress it feels very lightweight it is lined fully lined which is nice and let me tell you the materials it is 55% linen, 45% cotton, and the lining is 100% polyester. Now this dress might have been in clearance, and it still is in clearance. When I looked yesterday, they were still selling it. But this is a style of dress that Torrid sell a lot. And when I look on their website, I could see multiple colors, multiple patterns, multiple fabrics in this style. So if you like this style and how it fits me, then you absolutely can find other styles on the website. Just so you know, everything I ordered from Torrid is a size one, which is a 14, 16. So let me show you about the belt. This is how I'm gonna wear it today. This is my outfit of the day. Now let me show you out the belt. It doesn't absolutely need the belt. I just felt like I needed something to define my waist a little bit more. Anyhow, there it is without the belt. These buttons are not real, which is wonderful. It's a nice big skirt. It does show a tiny little bit of my bra, but I'm not worrying about that. And today is going to be sunny, so I'm trying to decide if I'm wearing a, a top to protect my shoulders or not. But this is essentially what I'm wearing today. All right, let's see the next items. This whole outfit is torrid. Let's start with the trousers. They are tapered leg crepe trousers with a nice high waist. They have a, the black and gold chains. So I brought these only because I wanted to try toy trousers. I've never, apart from the cloths, which I got in a size 12 and I've always regretted, or zero, I've always regret, regretted getting the zero. I've never tried toy trousers. I was really nervous to order the ones because I didn't know if it would jump or not in size. Like the zero just didn't fit me. It was just a little snug. And I do wear it, so it does fit me enough that I can wear it. But, and, and I took a chance on a clearance item, and they fit. And the reason I picked the chains is because I have a chain scarf. 
that I've never worn. And so now I can wear my chain scarf with my chain pants. They fit wonderfully. I'm not a tucker inner and I'm showing you this top tucked into it because I actually think these pants look really good with a top tucked in. And I can't believe I'm saying that. Like that's, that's not what I, how I wear things. I paid just over $26. I think I paid like $26.99. I got these trousers when they were 40% off. They are made from, dun, 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 let me see. And of course, it's right at the back. They are made from 94% polyester and 6% spandex. And I'm going to go back and look on the Torrid website because they have lots of these pants. And they're really comfortable. They're really lightweight. They are that... I'm going to cough, sorry. <coughs> they are that material that if you snag them, they're going to they're gonna snag. But they are very, very lightweight. I can move everywhere in them. They're slightly turned up at the ankle. I just, um, I'm actually really quite impressed and I really like these and I would like some more of them because they do fit really nicely. I'm not that hot right now. It's not that warm. It's uh, about nine o'clock in the morning and I'm interested to uh, how these will feel as it gets more humid because I've got a feeling they might stick to your legs, but I don't know that. Anyhow. Alright, on top I am wearing a Dolman Sleeve Slub Knit Tie Front Top. I'm going to put it out. I got this one also for 40% off. And this top was uh, just under, I think it was $17 or something. It's currently on the website for $16 something, so you can get it a little cheaper than I paid. Let me try and tie this a little bit better. The buttons are faux. It's just a very soft top. And it's nice and long at the back. You can make it shorter at the front, depending on how you tie it. It's a very basic top. It's very soft. It's very nice quality. And uh, everyone needs these basics. It's 65% polyester and 35% rayon. So it has a little stretch. The trousers have no stretch apart from the waistband, which is an, el it is an elastic waistband, in case you didn't say. Um, yeah, so there's the top. There's the pants. Really nice outfit. And they both fit. Thankfully. There's a close up of the the buttons. And I believe they're the same buttons as the dress. Let's have a look. Here's the dress. It's, these seem to be like torrid buttons. I guess they're they're different. They are different. Ones this is blacker and this is lighter brown. This bomber jacket doesn't go with these pants, but I don't have any other pants to show you it with. This is a bomber jacket. It is very, very lightweight. Uh, I paid just over $27. And it's, which is, what was a lot of money to chance, right? But luckily it worked. 100% polyester, which is exactly what it feels like. The material feels like the same kind of crepey material as the pants, which again means it will probably if I catch it or anything, it will pull. I brought this because of the bikes. It's covered in bikes and flowers. And because I am a cyclist and a commuter, I love clothing that has bikes on it. I would wear this to my classroom. I like to try and promote an active lifestyle to my students without like blatantly like saying you should be active all the time. And I try and promote it through what I wear and what I share about my life. And I think this is a great way to promote cycling, so I love it. I am a person that likes to go do jackets up. And I, I, I know lots of people say, oh, I never do it up. It doesn't matter if it doesn't join. But I actually do do mine up pretty frequently. And I do want it to join. This is not the best zipper in the world. I've had a few issues. See, it's now stuck there. I have a few issues with it. Um... Of course, it's going to get stuck now. Um, see, the, the zipper is not the best. Like, it's stuck. It's stuck there now. So, nope, I did it. Let's see if I can do it. Now I can do it up. Yeah, it's not the best zipper in the world. Not for how much they wanted originally for it. For the price originally was $65.50, and the zipper should be, like, glided at that price. But it fits me with a lot of room. The pockets are... Faux, which is fine because when I read the reviews for this, people were really complaining about the pockets and they thought that was kind of annoying. Uh, 
No, you know what? They are real pockets. They're just cut. They're just. They're just sealed shut. Well, people were complaining about that. And I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to wear this to cycle in. And when you cycle, you don't really want things flapping. So if these were to open and like flap around when you're recycling, that would be annoying. So I am going to keep them sealed just for practical um, wear. And yeah, but I really like this. It's really nice. It fits really well. I could see it with a black dress under. I could see it with like burgundy pants and a, this like black top. It's, it's a really nice jacket. I also brought some earrings. These are the earrings. They have like faux diamante stuck in the middle. I hope that doesn't fall off. And these were 50% off. So they claim, let me step out so you can see me. They claim they were $14.50 originally and I paid $5.99. And let's see what these look like. They got little, let me undo that right here. Okay, and put that one in my ear. My thought was that it would go with the um, chain pants. I thought that this would look really cool. So there's the earring. They are big. They're not particularly heavy. They're quite light, but there is a little tug in my ear, like a little, see them pull a little bit. I think they look really cool. I'm actually gonna put these in and wear them for the rest of the haul. Uh, at least they're easy to get in. Well, she says as she struggles. <laughs> we'll see. What are these made of? Does it say? A multi coin hoops. Nope, doesn't say anything. All right, there they are. They're off. There they are. They're really big. I love it. The only thing is they make a little bit of noise. So uh, we'll see if that gets on my nerves today. All right, so let's get the next outfit on. Again, this cardigan doesn't go with these pants, but it's it's lovely. It's a Hatchy cardigan. I think that's what they called it. Um, the sleeves are, what's that? Th three quarter, under three quarter, about two, three inches from my elbow, but they are bigger. I actually really like that. I think that's nice. It's a really nice fit. It's not an oversized fit at all. It fits me pretty perfectly. It does not have pockets, which is fine. I don't don't always need pockets. Um, I do like pockets, but I find that like over time they kind of start to sag a little bit. So maybe this will stay looking nicer for longer without it. It's extremely soft. It's extremely soft. It's 60% rayon, 38% polyester, 2% spandex. There's a couple more of these on the website that I have my eye on. Let me come closer so you can see this beautiful pattern. I thought this would be a really nice spring cardigan. Like when it's still cold. You know when it's really actually still winter, but in your head you're like, I'm ready for spring. Kind of mid-February. That's when I was thinking this cardigan would be great. It's high-low, which is one of my favorite ways to wear cardigans. It is long, which is again, one of my favorites. And it just feels really good. I paid, did I pay $18? I got this one at 50% off. And I love it. And like I said, I've got my eye on a couple more on their site. And I've got one more thing to show you from Torrid. Let me show you. I'm not going to put this on for you because it's completely see-through. This is a Torrid curve piece. I bought this at 40% off. So it cost me, I forget what I paid actually. It was 50. So 25 would be 50% off. So I guess I paid like 20 I don't know, 26 maybe, um, which seems like a lot of money, but I have a black one like this that I literally wear under dresses and it protects my shoulders a little bit. I wear it a, a lot during the spring and I've always wanted a white one. The black one I have was from Goodwill. I've always wanted a white one because I feel like white is a little bit springier and this one is long sleeves, but I put it on and I can push it up. It's literally a mesh white top it's it's what it is and I got this in a size again a one and it's it's everything I wanted it to be which is really just a simple under top and it fits fine it is cropped and it does have an elastic here which stops it from rising up over your boobs but when I'm wearing it underneath stuff it tends to the top I have doesn't have that and it stays down all right so that's everything I brought from the Torrid website but I actually have three more dresses to share with you. I just, 
three more dresses to share with you that I bought recently from Fred Up, but I sent most of the order back and I have a bit of an addiction to Thread Up, so I've already filmed my July Thread Up haul, and I don't want to film August. It's just the, it's the middle of June. I didn't want to f film August is yet, so I sent most of that order back. But these three Tory dresses came from that order, and I'd like to share them with you now because, like I said, they might not be the exact dresses that Tory is selling today, but Tory likes to use the same, like most sites, the same styles with different patterns over and over. This is the first Torah dress from Thread Up. It is a faux wrap dress with a little tie that doesn't really do anything. It's there, I can make it tighter, but it doesn't really do a lot. It looks, but it makes me look like a real wrap. There's a, an elastic band under the chest area right here. And if you see my other videos, you know I don't always like a lot of elastic, but this elastic is loose enough that it is not gonna bother me. I just thought, look at these sleeves. And we come closer so you can see the pattern. I just thought this was summery goodness. Like, so pretty. It's that very um, synthetic material. I want to say 100% polyester. Look, it's lined. Where's the label? There it is. Yes, 100% polyester and 100% polyester. So, yeah, 100% polyester. Don't go near a fire. But this dress is adorable. And... One of the reasons I like buying Torridge dresses on Thread Up is because these dresses end up costing around $23.99 usually on, on Thread Up. And you can return them. So if it's clear Torrid clearance prices with the ability to return it if it doesn't fit. And so at Thread Up it is a $1.99 restocking fee. But that's better than being stuck with an item that doesn't fit. So that's why I like Thread Up for Torrid. And also, Thread Up right now have a like a point system. I'm hoping they're going to keep that going forever. And once you spend money, you earn points. And if you get 600 and something points, you can return stuff for free. So, and it's easy to get 600 points. Like pretty much every order you make will get that many points. Anyhow, here's this dress. It's completely, completely adorable. I love it. I can't wait to wear it. And yeah, this just screams summer goodness. Uh, here's the next dress. It is really pretty. It is black and white floral with a nice frilly top. Let me come closer so you can see. It has like rufflies. I don't know if you can see them. Come really close and hope that you can. It's really pretty detail. Here's the pattern. It has a big thick band. Now when I first put this on, I was like, I can feel that band. Is that going to annoy me? And you know what? I think I'm okay with it because it is thicker. It's not like a thin point of pushing against me. It's like a thick, it feels like I'm wearing a belt. And I do put belts in my dresses. So if I can wear a belt, I can have this big thick elastic. It's really pretty, it fits really well. It's very lightweight. I would say it's again 100% polyester, but we'll double check, there's the line in. Yes, it is all 100% polyester. It's just a really nice, easy, breezy summer dress and I love it. Again, $23.99 from Thread Up. This is the last dress I have to share with you today, the last item of clothing, and it's another beautiful summer dress. It has these lovely sleeves that cover my arms and stop the sun getting to me. And I love it. It has a tie neck and a big opening underneath. And it comes down, there is a band, but this band is not very tight. There's no stretch in it at all, but it's not very tight and it fits nicely and then it just flows over everything. Let me come closer so you can see the pattern. It is black with flowers all over it. It's a really nice dress. It again feels very polyester-y. I mean, it, there's, I don't know why I'm checking, it's 100% polyester. And it is 100% polyester. It's, uh, it's really nice. I have a, a thing for about synthetic material. It's not my favorite. And when companies make items that are synthetic and charge like $70 for it, it kind of annoys me. Like it's not that of, a, of an expensive material. And if I'm gonna spend like $70 for a dress, it's gonna have some color and some linen in it. And so that's a, another reason why I like Fred Up because I don't mind paying $23.99 or $24, $25 for synthetic. 
and I love the fact that it's already been worn, it's more sustainable, all that jazz. Anyhow, <laughs> that's not what this video is about, this is a Tory video. Um, but I love this dress, and I am slowly falling in love with Tory dresses. I don't know, slowly is not the answer. I'm like falling in love with Tory dresses, and Tory in general, I just, I'm a little cheap, and I don't want to pay full price. This is the last dress I have to share with you today, the last item of clothing, and it's another beautiful summer dress has these lovely sleeves that cover my arms and stop the sun getting to me and I love it, it has a tight neck and a big opening underneath and it comes down, there is a band but this band is not very tight, there's no stretch in it at all but it's not very tight and it fits nicely and then it just flows over everything. Let me come closer so you can see the pattern. It is black with flowers all over it. It's a really nice dress. It again feels very polyester-y. I mean, it, there's, I don't know why I'm checking. It's 100% polyester. And it is 100% polyester. It's, uh, it's really nice. I have a, a thing for about synthetic material. It's not my favorite. And when companies make items that are synthetic and charge like $70 for it, it kind of annoys me. Like it's not that of, a, of an expensive material and if I'm going to spend like $70 for a dress, it's got to have some color and some linen in it. And so that's a, another reason why I like Fred Up because I don't mind paying $23.99 or $24, $25 for synthetic. And I love the fact that it's already been worn, it's more sustainable, all that jazz. Anyhow, <laughs> that's not what this video is about, this is a Tory video. Um, but I love this dress and I am slowly falling in love with Tory dresses. I don't know, slowly is not the answer. I'm like falling in love with Tory dresses and Tory in general. I just, I'm a little cheap and I don't want to pay full price. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed watching me try on these Tory clothes. I am finding that a Tory size 1 does fit my size 14 maybe higher end of 14 body very nicely and the quality is pretty good if you can get the price right. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumb up, thumbs up, consider subscribing and I would love to see you again in another video. I think I forgot to say but I'm five foot four and a half if that helps with height ratio and uh, yeah, have a great day and I'll see you again.